de Jong at the Bernabeu. Next time he visits, it will be 3-0 at Feyenoord last midweek. But they're not in top form at the moment. Benzema trying to put that right. De Jong is taken off it by De Jong. There's a snapshot of the player they want. Doesn't it? The invention and confidence they had. This is De Jong when he wins this ball and he just bursts out. This is protecting it from Masrawi. Lovely first on the territory they seek to occupy. He just pinches it. Look, just sweeping across. To occupy. And so far. He just pinches it. Look. Not often in the history of this race. Look at that composure there. I mean, playing wonderfully well with great deal of confidence. The way they handle the ball, De Jong with particular. On the subject of uh, the Welsh superstar, rolls it out. Carver Hulls kept on running. Snatch back from him by De Jong. Modric leaning away from De Jong, away from Neres. And dancing himself, Luka Modric. of uh, the Welsh superstar for and against in the course of recent days his agent to go to Munich that is goalless after the first leg same time same chance De Jong Busquets has been a key figure in that midfield so far tonight De Jong won two challenges there held as far as Modric to home deficit Playing here behind a big. De Jong. Put on the ball and keep it if they can. Exactly. Fred of the manager just went off, got a round of applause for them. De Jong. He's been wonderful, hasn't he, De Jong? Just a four there. Torberg. De Jong. in world football started as an old horse race track in Madrid in 1902. Old times at Old Trafford. The breakout star at Barcelona or one of them. Frankie de Jong to play this one in. Oh. Frankie de Jong. De Jong. Analysis coming up on this game, Mr. Young plays this one through. Gabby and Lewandowski waiting in the middle. Easy for him. 2 0 Barcelona. Like shelling peas, that one. And Lewandowski now has his first ever goal in the Classico. And he was very good, you know, very, very good player. After their players are away on international duty, the opposite for Barcelona. This is De Young. Waits for the runners. A willing runner on that left hand side. Rafinha joining in. That's it. Okay. That 
they had lost at Mallorca in La Liga. That handed Barcelona the initiative in the title race. And Barca do have a very handy seven-point lead, and that is despite their defeat at Amaria. And sometimes, sometimes it works. Ball taking no chances, just sliding that ball wide very quickly, Courtois. Dion. No Lewandowski up there tonight for Barca, of course, but he did find Ferran Torres. Tersen. De Jong. De Jong. Cruz on to him quick. Yeah, that's just what you want to hear, those whistles. They don't like it when, as the opposition, you keep possession. And it's a, the best spell of possession for Barcelona. We're not untroubled. Were, sorry, were untroubled by that. This is backwards when, with the uh, Real Madrid man down, it might have been moved forward. And now De Jong's got to fight his way through a thicket of Real Madrid players, and he's not done so. And he actually has got a free kick out of that, which lets Barca off the hook, oh, followed a by a yellow card. Furiated everyone. They're, they're just literally, Paul, physically engaged, Vinicius and Dion, and they're holding one another. The absolutely goal is good. Correct, absolutely correct. Kessie forced the issue. There may have been a tiny touch off around Madrid. The round. Let's out. He went back. Obviously, goal bound, but for me, Nacho has the last touch. He's he trying should, to clear he could it. have cleared it. It's to Cecil again. Just has that elegance in his game that's given to so many left footers. To the left, they go. Well, he's certainly he's, he's punching his weight. That's in edge to take a chance. Advantage play. Balde was fouled. Real Madrid have got a shuffle across Carvajal. Valverde found the room on the edge of the box in the first half of this film. Gets stoked up again as we go here in the second half. Still credit. Uh, the two midfield partners, Luka Modric and uh, Tony Cruz, are not the attacking midfield players that are going to return. Madrid. Edged out Casareño. Moreover, over, they needed their top guns to get the goals in that game. Rodrigo, Benzema. And Usman Dembele not involved for Barcelona got the goal against Wales. So we'll get the teams on your screens very shortly and uh, go through them with uh, Victor and Chappy. The record between uh, Xavi and Carlo, it's uh, he won the first meeting between the two teams. They behave like in cup game where they press very high and very well. They, they... Sergi Busquets. And one of the solutions, Peter, is exactly what we've seen. Uh, Modric normally try to pick uh, Sergio Busquets. So tonight, the same behavior from Real Madrid, and let's see if Barca has found the solution. Valdez found some space out uh, on the left. Valverde goes, Valverde goes across. Ball is pulled back to Frankie De Jong. Gets to Barcelona, back to De Jong. He's got Baldi to his left. Plays instead to Lewandowski. He spins about from Tony Cross and gets the shot in. It comes out to Baldi. Has Runs out to Araujo, he's got away from Vinicius, Araujo's cross is charged down, it comes out to Rafinha, through the crowd, another opportunity into the back of the net, and Barcelona are back on level terms, and it's Sergio Roberto who's got the goal just before half-time. And then happen what happened. gets his phone Rafinha Rafinha the header it comes Courtois pushes the ball away Carvajal heads, heads it to the edge of the area the shot comes in it's over the top from Sergio Roberto Barcelona really pressing yeah. in the opening exchanges Very powerful by driving the ball forward breaking lines of pressing and uh Thank you, De Jong De Jong delivers the cross and it's almost turned in the area out comes Courtois Carvajal once more and again the pressing Paying off for Barcelona. The quick throw, though, goes straight to Militao. Here's Cameron. Floated in towards Kunde. Goes over his head. In the ball to Barca because of the high pressing and because they have the capacity to keep the ball. They create danger and uh, it's going to be a very, a very level game. At the moment, it's been a very level. Possibly the first ten minutes a little bit more for Barcelona, but 
we'll see We've actually seen him stick very much to this near touch line. Yeah, I think it's a decision of the player. It's, uh, it's more that uh, what Vinicius want to do during the during the game, and he has the freedom to to take his own decision. Pass was short, and uh, well, the referee's happy for the play to continue. There are two players down, one from each side. Frankie de Jong finds Balde, Sergio Roberto and Gabi in the middle, but it will be Nacho, guys, that takes the corner short to Frankie de Jong. De Jong delivers the cross, and it's almost turned in. Well, another half chance for Barcelona, and it was uh, Christensen once more, his second of the first half. Here's 